uh, concluded. Jay. This is the second serious security breach to take place under Director Sullivan's watch. The first one, of course, has to do with the White House crashers uh, for the state dinner. How many incidents like this do there have to be before the President loses confidence in a Secret Service Director? I will restate what I've said, Jake. The President has confidence in Director Sullivan. Uh, he has uh, great appreciation and regard for uh, the men and women of the Secret Service who um, perform their duties admirably and at, and at risk uh, to their own lives. The, uh, that is not to excuse any behavior or activity that uh, was inappropriate. Uh, the incident is under investigation. But again, I think it is uh, what more unhelpful. <laughs> what more? Do, uh, quite a bit more, Jake. That this thing is under investigation. This this at incident. 11, at least this Secret incident Service became uh, happened last week. Became public uh, very quickly after it happened. Uh, the investigation was launched immediately, and we're several days into an investigation. I think it is in very much in the interests of. everyone, and most importantly of the uh, United States and its uh, security service here, the Secret Service with regards to uh, the, the mission it um, is charged with, uh, to allow this investigation to uh, be completed before uh, we make judgments based on conclusions we don't yet have. The President talks a lot about accountability, people in the government being held accountable. It seems as though incidents happen in this administration and have happened in this administration, and people are not held accountable. Jake, Maybe lower level. Let, let me let me just. I, I I know you were covering this yesterday, but based on the reports I read that I think you and others filed, uh, people have already been held that. accountable or have held themselves accountable in this very incident that has been under investigation for a few days. So okay. I think the Maurice swift. Have a plaque on his desk that said the buck stops there. Okay. Jay, the point I, is that their accountability what, rises. People are in charge of agencies, and they are held accountable for the behavior right. of the people that they are in and charge perhaps, of. And perhaps, Jake, perhaps it would be in the in interest of uh, a complete and thorough and fair investigation uh, not to uh, make determinations about the conclusions of an investigation before they've even been reached. That's the President's position. I think that is a position that is uh, fits naturally into a general sense of uh, appropriateness and justice and the pursuit of the truth, uh, and that is uh, the position we're going to take. I have one other, yeah. one other 